Hi everyone here. I've got a dog crate uh, and I was going to talk about the many uses that you can use uh, dog crates for. I think they're kind of one of those things that if you're going to have poultry, these are really useful to have. Uh, one of the main uses I use it for is a makeshift infirmary. So if I've got one of my ducks get sick and it's not something like serious or even if it is, it's just something I can set up real quick and easy. I can get the duck in there with some water and I can monitor over the night. I often use it for like egg binding um, where I can see them overnight or if it's something like Bumblefoot where it's going to be a little more long term. But I don't really need them inside, but I want to keep them a little bit separated from the flock. I can put this in the coop and keep them separated at night where they can still be happy, see their friends at night. Uh, and it's not quite so strenuous. So this makes a great makeshift infirmary that's just easy, especially if you need to bring them inside. Um, that's one great use. Another great use I use it for is for integration. So when I'm bringing in new ducks um, or I've raised new ducklings and I'm getting them into the flock, uh, one part of that is getting them ready to go out into the coop. And so I can put this in the coop and they can be safe in that coop uh, apart from the ducks where they're not going to have to worry about being bullied or picked on because especially in a coop there it's going to be closed quarters they're not going to have any wiggle room to get away from uh, anything so this keeps them safe where they can experience that with the other ducks and kind of getting used to each other in a more safe environment the last thing I use it for is for transporting animals. So if I'm picking up a new duck from someone um, or if you need to even take it to like a vet or something, this would be a great way to sort of move your, your animals around um, if you need to. It's just, it's an easy way. I can just throw it in my um, SUV or truck or whatever I need to uh, and get it around um, pretty easily. This particular crate here that I have is a Midwest crate. I've had this one for four years for my ducks. Uh, it's been great. It's easy to take down. It's really stood the test of time. Um, and it, you know, it's been absolutely great. I also have another Midwest crate uh, that I use for my dog that I've actually had for 11 years. It's a two door one. Um, it's great as well. It, you, same thing, easy to take apart, easy to set up, so super easy. Um, I kind of wish when I got this one for the ducks, uh, I had gotten a two-door one. I didn't think at the time that I was really going to need the two-door one. I liked the two-door one for the dogs because we had been moving around a lot. I could reorient the crate any way I wanted to, uh, and I figured out for the ducks, I'd, I really only need one door. But I wish I'd gotten the two door for the ducks uh, because there are times where you can see that doors at the front, they're in the back corner. I have to crawl into that crate to go get them. So it would have been nice to have a door on the side also uh, just to make things easier uh, to get ducks out if I needed to or putting them in or if I was changing waters out or just things like that where a two door would have actually been a little bit nicer. So if you found this video helpful, uh, please consider pecking that like button. If you want to see more content like this, subscribe. You can also check us out on Instagram. Uh, that's it for this one. Spread those wings and keep on quacking.